2006. Alright. You can see that up there. If we can get a little bit close up footage. Probably not because of the sun. Never mind. We'll go down see where it goes. Yeah, we'll just go so far down then. Sort it. Unusual, isn't it? To find something like that down here. We'll just go and take a look anyway if, uh, if this path takes us to it and then we'll head off back down to where that pub is go and see all that Halloween stuff okay it's brought us out onto the road somewhere Be a lot easier, I think. Mukton, two miles, all Thorpe, six miles, hanging pastures. I don't know where it's brought us out at. Keep to the side. I think this place is called Core Thorpe. Yeah, sure 
sure that's what it is. Come on then, we'll go and take a look anyway. And we'll walk back down the old path. Yeah, but we didn't expect this, did we? So it's Cawthorpe and Legbourne together. Might be an entrance somewhere. <coughs> cool, blimey, that's steep. Wow. No, seriously. That is steep. Look at that in the background, wow. Seem that door open one for a, a second. Mm, oh. Watch that. Oh, it's another unusual church, but it's fine. It is a bit dark in here, but can't help it. Yeah, another stunning church come across. So I think this one is in Cawthorpe. I think it is. Because the name of the road what we've just passed is Cawthorpe on it. But obviously when you're following when you're following different little cut-offs it takes you anywhere. No. Like I said, it is a bit dark in here, so I can't help it. Hmm. Nice so still the, still the church at the end of the day. Oh wow, I didn't see that. Got our YouTube channel in it as well. Yeah, I can see you. So what you see underneath the bottom of the church. Well, it's a nice one. So we're going to head back and have had a quick look in this church. So it definitely comes under Cawthorpe anyway, which we did not know. So we're going to head back through that little uh, lane and head back to where the pub is, take a, a look at the pub as well. well it's a really nice church. Wind's picked up. Hi. Yeah. Oh, there's another part of the graveyard just over to my left. Must be like an overflow graveyard. You can go 
old bulls and cows. Now, I just have to get some more footage where we can. See if I can zoom into that old wooden bridge. Somewhere, where is it? Oh, it's there. Yeah, it brings you so far up, doesn't it? And then it'll. Thing is, it's where is all this water running from? That's the that's the bit that I don't get because the actual stream is running down, right? So there's got to be a way somewhere further up that top, which we don't know, without walking all the way around. But I know that's why I noticed on the way up. So I'm gonna that's it. That what? Not for an old light. Little car thought. Hmm. Yeah, but. Hey. So you what? That's nice. Let me just see if I can zoom into that because that is absolutely beautiful to look at. There's a name on it, so I'll see if we can get the name as well. <coughs> Cherry Tree Cottage. Yeah, look, look how stunning. I'll tell you what, though, I bet that's got some right age to it. Well, that is really nice. Yeah. Do like that. I know it wins big right up there, hasn't it? Over to the pub, then we'll take a walk around the Halloween stuff as well. Right, as well. No, this is what I was saying. This goes up here, but it's how far it goes up. Or oh, did you want to have a bit of a walk up and then walk back down yeah, to the pub? Uh, no, but you'll have to keep to the side if you do, or if you're not bothered, we'll just go into the pub. I'm not worried. Right, the van coming. Right, come to this side then, because we're going in here.
Wait a minute, I'll be there. Right, I'm going to come round. What? Well, uh, Feely spotted something. Alright, oh, yeah, you can, can't you? Look, right at right the back, where I'm stuck. We've got another one, a metal one, but it's not working. Alright, oh, they have, yeah. Right. I've been watching. <laughs> I've been watching this here. Right, hang on then. Right, you'll be careful coming down here. Do you want to go the opposite way round? Because I'm gonna gonna hear this one. I'm gonna lift my camera up. Yeah, I just saw that metal one over there. And I thought, well, it's not working. So. Right. Well, I'm just gonna lift my camera up near this wall and see if I can try to zoom in right just come right to the side oh go near the bridge
Yeah, but I did it last time though, wasn't it? Yeah, right at the back, though. We can get it from here. There, look. Can you see it? Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. Camera's just gone doggy again. I've got this one going round. That's why I put it up over the edge. Oh my god. Is that a jack? Yeah. Oh my god, I did not see that. I'm going to have to zoom into that as well. Yeah. Alright, hang on then. If anybody can spot that peeking straight through all the. Uh, well, where the camera's facing. Wow. Didn't even know that were there. So the back. Oh yeah, they have, aren't they? Yeah. yeah, right at the back. But it's not going round. No, I've noticed it's not going round, is it? It's a really big shame as well, that, isn't it? Mm. It's a really big shame. I'm going to see if I can just put the camera back up over the uh, hedge. If I can. Where is it? Oh, I was wondering. I can't see it from this side. I'm just going to try and come a little bit further up. See if I can. I know, I'm just trying to find it because I spotted it through the edge. Ah, oh, it's there. I don't know if you'll be able to see it because I can't. I don't really know if I managed to get any uh, better footage on that, but... Right, hang on, <laughs> I just put it through the edge, thinking, well, it might have been nice to try and get it, you know what I mean, that little bit better, but... It's worth it anyway, worth a try, even if I didn't get it, but... Yeah, so, I've got two. Right, we'll crack on then and take a, a walk up here. I'll just re grab this board actually. So, for them where it was just a little bit further away, now obviously you should be able to get a really good close up now and read that properly.
Right, so we're going to take a walk up this side. Oh, yeah, this gate here. Yeah, that one is. Well, we're going to carry on up here. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Really big shame. Right, I just want to merely point out as well. Uh, I know a lot of my videos run on a little longer. And I'm sorry that somebody keeps inboxing me and uh, saying here we go again, another 40 minute video. Uh, take you 40 minutes out of their life, apparently, and apparently my videos are so boring or something. I'm trying to say pathetic, whoever it was. And on the top of it, there's people out there what does enjoy little villages like these. So I uh, just wanted to uh, just make that point and clear. So if you do find our uploads boring, I will probably say do not watch them. But for them what do, please enjoy. And thank you to everybody who has subscribed. And it'd be nice to keep them subscribers. Even though we do keep losing some, but that's life. <laughs> but please subscribe as well if you if you do like any of our uploads or you want to be part of our channel and enjoy. Nineteen thirteen. Right, just keep to the side. And then we'll just have a walk to where that old building is up here and then we'll head back. Rosewood Cottage. Yeah, what uh, what a date. Nineteen thirteen. Culloden House and Hamilton House. Yeah, the date on that was 1913 on that big white one. This is stunning though. Very stunning. What's that one then? Sheely. Oh wow, different, unusual. Sunny Oak. It's really nice that. Yeah, so let's see what this is up here. It's really old building. <laughs> this looks like an old school. Oh, that's nice. That is nice, that. This definitely looks like some type of old school or something. Could be wrong. Might even be right. Wow, look at that. That is really nice. That is really nice, that. Well, what's that? Lyle Lace Cottage. Yes, very nice. Something just to your right. Let's quickly take a look. This takes you back out of the village. Oh, well, you 
infinity. Very nice. Uh, and that's it, really. Apart from there's an old cottage right in the background. But that's just one of them things. Right, so we're going to head back then. And back uh, to follow the Ford back round to where we're parked. around this part anyway it's a bit more quieter but you can expect it but yeah what a nice place so when we first come we only walked more or less down to where the big windmill was but yeah Empty lapis, isn't it? hey oh sunny out Surprising though, when you come to little villages, how quirky a lot of these cottages and that is. <laughs> and especially the, like the names on them, how different and that they are as well. I mean, this one, it's got an electric charger. Right, let's get to the side. Just in case. Planting, planting side. And busting lane. And pinfall lane. Yeah, that one there, 1913. I'll tell you what though, looks like it's been well looked after since all them years. So yeah, so that just takes you back out, back towards Laworth, which is, uh, I think, I think that board said three miles earlier. Yeah. Colonial Cottage. Nice so what a name. It's different, it's unusual. That's a bit of a good thing. Oh wow, look at them statues there, look. Oh wow, look at them. Oh they're gorgeous. Proper little statues. Very nice. This is what I said about villages. They've got such quirky properties. And then you see these really wonderful statues in the gardens. What sets it off? It really does. <coughs> right, I'll bring you back when we get down to the Ford. Yeah, it does happen. Tell you what though, a lot of people in places like these, they like to spend money on... Uh... Oh, hang on, I've just seen another date. Yeah, I have. Uh, Brook and Dean 1925, if anybody can make that out. There you go, another date of property, 1925, I didn't see that. Never mind, we, don't, we know now. Right, I'll just re-show that little water wheel off again, before we uh, head off. Because we're back down to the Ford now, so I'm going to wrap this video up shortly when we get down the bottom as well. And yes, it probably will be about 40 minutes long, or just over, or just under something. Let's point out. So, uh, yeah, and that's why I said earlier about the stupid comment. You're just getting blocked anyway, but you know, it's not the point point is there's people what enjoys village walks and stuff and it's nice to leave the comments on for them so they can make a comment you know about each individual upload and uh, you get some idiot who's trying to spoil it for everybody else ridiculous
Yeah, so I've had a walk to Colthorpe and obviously now we're back into part of Legbourne. Just think, if this was a lot deeper, you could put a bloody dinghy on it, couldn't you, and enjoy yourself. Just dinging up and down it, I think it'd be brilliant. This part, yes, towards the pub and that, but where we've just walked, I'm going to say barely anybody would walk up there, but... I'll have to zoom into this statue up, because honestly we did not see this last time we come. Yeah, didn't see that. Didn't even see that other one, but... Yeah, yeah, it was a nice view though, wasn't it? Yeah. Lovely view. That's why I just put the camera a little hole in the edge, moved a couple of leaves to one side, put the camera down, and then tried to zoom into it because it is really nice. But I didn't see that they've got two uh, water wheels, but like you said, they've got the wooden one, they've got a metal one as well. But it's a shame, yeah, it's a shame as we couldn't have got a lot closer because that would have been. Absolutely lovely, it really would. Yeah, and that's the thing, isn't it? <laughs> you can't just go opening gates and walking up people's paths, which that would have been nice to do, with permission, of course. With permission, but you know, it's one of them things. Uh, but anyway, yeah, apart from that, I'm gonna wrap the video up uh, shortly because uh, I did turn around and tell Will that. When I come back, I'm going to re-show his uh, boards for his business. And I told his wife as well, who I spoke to. So, I will be doing that. So, I will be re-pausing the video shortly. And then you'll see the information from their business. But, I'm not allowed to go directly through the gate. But I can film the boards and that. And I can also um, re-film the... The actual water mill as well but of course not going directly down will's yard again without asking him again so uh so there you have that so you will be seeing the boards from their business So if anybody is thinking of having a bit of a break, at least you'll, you'll have a nice place to, to contact and come and take a break. So right, I'll bring you back when we get down, further down to where the uh, big water mill is. Yeah, so this is uh, Will and his wife's business. So yeah, if you're looking for anywhere to get away for a bit of a break, contact Mill Street. Big thumbs up from me, it's a big thumbs up from Keeley, and uh, we will see each and every one of you on the next one. 
and uh, as I explained earlier if you don't like any of our uploads then please don't watch it uh, but the, biz the two business boards that I've just shown you a few minutes back further up uh, like I said you contact them uh, and you're wanting a break Will's wife she's the one that does all that side of things um, but anything to do with the um, Alston trout or whatever that's obviously Will deals with that so uh, right bye for now and we'll see each and every one of you for the next one and if you're new to the channel it's completely free to subscribe as well well as I explained if, you, if you're not really into our channel or into our uploads then either aid on the lead on next to the comments and see, um, try and find something that you are going to enjoy. Bye for now.